this is amazing like you don't have to go anywhere you just have to look outside your window and there you see it the northern lights yesterday I was freezing out there so today we are going to get the catch and Matty has been kind enough to offer me some of his gear which is the polar bear pants and this jacket how cool is it Got the main part. Okay, so we'll see you out there. And as you can see, we have reached our spot. It's time to get off the sled. Okay, so we just caught this fish, just sliced it open and we're gonna have it. How is it? Not bad, it's good. You know, a lot of uh, Japanese people we s will be so angry on you. Why? Because we want to taste it also. Ah. Yeah. The rest, we're not eating it, but the dog, they like it. My hands are freezing. But eat more and you will not freeze. The fat in the fish will make your, your body as production warm. But How was that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so at first it, the idea of eating a raw fish sounded disgusting to me but uh, it, it was good but the only problem is my hands are freezing I need to put the gloves again <laughs> Not so cold <laughs> Yeah, for you it's not cold uh, but for an Indian For an Indian guy who has never seen this cold before? <laughs> it's okay. Oh, 
Such so a Today is a really warm day, and uh, I'm going to Marty's place. Grandma invited us for a lunch, so it will be a really authentic Greenland, Greenlandic lunch. Yeah, so I'm at Marty's uh, grandma's place to have some Greenlandic lunch, and this is. This is the fish that we caught yesterday, right? Yeah. Okay, this is the meat fish meatball. And this is uh, uh, this is some fish with vinegar and sugar and onion, right? Uh, thanks grandma for making the lunch for us. Oh, I shall have a cook. I'm a cook. She had make it. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay, let's have it. Hello guys, uh, I'm just back uh, after spending uh, 40 minutes outside and you can see that my lens is all fogged up. Not fucked up, I said fogged up. Okay, I'll shoot the rest of the video once my lens clears out. Okay, I was uh, going out uh, just to buy some dinner. And when I just stepped out of my house, I looked at the sky and there were beautiful, beautiful northern lights. So um, I just walked up to the sea and uh, the experience was amazing. Like I always thought that, so just like the time lapse of the clouds, the clouds appear to be moving in a time lapse. Like when you look at them with your naked eye, very rarely you see them moving, right? Because they're moving so slow. So I always thought that the northern lights are also the same. That like they are not moving. It's just that when we click it and, you know, when we uh, make a time lapse of it, only then they are moving. But I was wrong. Today I saw the northern lights moving. Like they were like really uh like over my head and they were moving like in real time such a good experience and i have clicked some time lapse as well so i'll show you that And then I, I came up and the northern lights uh, were like getting even more beautiful. So I clicked some of the pictures from like the road outside my house. So I'll show you that picture now. This is amazing. Like you don't have to go anywhere. You just have to look outside your window and there you see it, the northern lights. It was snowing all day, so I did nothing, um, just shot some b-roll, I wish I had a gimbal with me. Anyways, I think it turned out well, what do you think? Let me know in the comments. This was how the sea looked from my house, yeah I could, I could hear the dogs barking all day, all night. In the next video, you will meet my host Abby and I will go to the school, I have to teach the kids, uh, well not kids, they were teenagers and it was really difficult. So yeah, if you like the video, subscribe to the channel, press the bell icon, share it with your friends and I will see you in the next video.
is it still recording oh shit yeah so um just one more thing uh do watch the previous three vlogs if you haven't um yeah that's pretty much it uh yeah bye